The Senate voted overwhelmingly on Tuesday night to give final approval to a $95.3 billion package of aid to Ukraine, Israel, and Taiwan, sending it to President Biden and ending months of uncertainty about whether the United States would continue to back Kiev in its fight against Russian aggression. The vote reflected resounding bipartisan support for the measure, which passed the House on Saturday by lopsided margins after a tortured journey on Capitol Hill, where it was nearly derailed by right-wing resistance. The Senate's action, on a vote of 79 to 18, provided a victory for the president, who had urged lawmakers to move quickly so he could sign it into law. And it capped an extraordinary political saga that raised questions about whether the United States would continue to play a leading role in upholding the international order and projecting its values globally. In a statement minutes after the vote, Mr. Biden said he would sign the bill into law and address the American people as soon as it reaches my desk tomorrow so we can begin sending weapons and equipment to Ukraine this week. Congress has passed my legislation to strengthen our national security and send a message to the world about the power of American leadership. We stand resolutely for democracy and freedom and against tyranny and oppression, he said.